If you're here, it means that you are looking for a great acceleration tip that relate to intermittent fasting that will help your intermittent fasting works better then you're in the right place my friend before we continue check out my ultimate guide to intermittent fasting in the description below if you're really serious about intermittent fasting subscribe to this channel if you want more fitness advice weight loss advice intermittent fasting advice subscribe click the bell notification here all right let's go on and i will share with you the tip that i've used to accelerate my weight loss with intermittent fasting a few weeks back, I've been doing a one meal a day diet. So it means for 24 hours, I was doing intermittent fasting. I was eating one meal for five days, one meal a day, Monday to Friday. So check out my video on it. I will link it here alongside this video. Uh, check it out from Monday to Friday. I will, I will give you all the details there and what happened uh, each day when I ate one meal per day. But that's not what we are going to talk about in this video. But in this video, it, it is something that really acceleration. It's an accelerator when I use it with my intermittent fasting. So it will work better with when you are doing intermittent fasting. So I was eating one meal per day around 6 p.m. All right, guys. So it means from 6 p.m. till I go to bed at maybe 10 p.m. Then uh, until the morning when I hit the gym at 4.30 a.m. I was not consuming anything. All right. So I went to bed on an empty stomach. I woke up on an empty stomach. I slept for eight hours, uh, for six hours on an empty stomach. And when I hit the gym, the first thing that I do. Okay. The first thing that I was doing, it was hit training. So I fasted for long hours. I've my stomach is empty, my body in, is in detox mode, a lot, a lot of benefit here, I'm, feel, I'm feeling a lot of energy. And then when I hit the gym, I do HIIT training. What HIIT training means, it's that um, it's not traditional cardio, it's, it's really a, a short period of cardio, maybe 10 minutes of cardio, but you do it really fast and slow. So I hop on the treadmill, I will do... Um, 20 seconds really f i will run really fast and for 20 seconds i will walk okay i will slow down so i will do this 20 second fast 20 seconds slow 20 second fast 20 seconds slow it's when i say fast i say the fastest you can go on a treadmill okay you have to really feel feel the pain of running fast so if you you have to and this is a great heat training is a great way because you don't do it for long, for, for normal cardio, you will do it around 20 to 30 minutes, but this is only 10 minutes. But in this 10 minutes, if you apply this HIIT hit training system, 20 seconds on, 20 seconds off, okay, it will be a great benefit if you're doing intermittent fasting to lose weight. And what this does, science has proven that HIIT training uh, accelerate weight loss. So when you do HIIT training, uh, you do this uh, kind of training 20 minutes, 20 second fast and 20 second slow for 10 minutes. Then during four, until the next 40, 48 hours, science has proven that your body will keep on, keep on burning fat. Okay, try it guys, try it. Uh, I've been doing this for one week and I've lost weight really, really fast. And the great idea about HIIT training is that it's not like traditional cardio. And this system uh, helps to, to maintain your muscle, your, your mass. It, like normal, traditional cardio, they will, uh, it, you will lose mass with time. You will lose, lose your, your body mass, your, your muscle mass. But with HIIT training, you don't lose your muscle mass. Just take an example, the marathon runner's body and the foot play, football player's body. See the difference. Football player, they run fast and they slow down. They run fast and they slow down. Marathon runner, they just keep on running slow. So this is the way that you will lose your mass. But heat training, you won't lose your mass. If you, don't, if you want example on it, uh, type, type on YouTube heat training, H-I-I-T training. You will see the examples of it and you can try it in the gym. But if you've been 
if you've, if you've done fasting for long hours, then on an empty stomach you hit the gym and you do hit training, it will really, really accelerate your weight loss. I've tried this for, 20, for five days and um, I had to stop because it, I was losing weight really fast. Um, I had to stop because I want to keep a little size. I don't want to get too thin. But guys, this is a system that I, that I, that I notice and if, if in the future I need to lose weight again, then I will try it again. It's simple. Okay, just try HIIT training on an empty stomach uh, after intermittent fasting. So in your last hours of intermittent fasting, just go on HIIT training. Do HIIT training for 10 minutes. It will accelerate your weight loss journey. Okay, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video, guys. Check out my ultimate guide to intermittent fasting in the description below. A great guide if you're just starting out or if you want more information, you want to go deeper into intermittent fasting, check out my ultimate guide there. And subscribe to this channel if you want weight loss, fitness, intermittent fasting advice. Subscribe to this channel because there's a lot to come here. Okay, guys, thank you. It was Linden from Mastery Era. See you in the next one.